uh, we can a little bit uh, uh, have to clarify uh, and understand uh, what is this uh, inverted funnel concept means. Because uh, uh, without understanding the inverted funnel concept, uh, we cannot uh, understand uh, the role of uh, the, the core product in this uh, strategy. So let, let me start first uh, with this uh, inverted funnel concept. It's, uh, it's nothing fancy. Uh, you don't have to over overthink it. It's uh, basically creating uh, seamless marketing funnels for your prospects that uh, always show them the next logical step. You don't sell, you just offer an upgrade option for your prospects. It's so important that I, I, want, I want to repeat it. So you, in this uh, concept, you don't sell, you just offer an upgrade option for your prospects. It it's consists of uh, three stages the core product, the buyer converter product, and the hooks. And every stage uh, should be developed from inside. Firstly, you need to think about your core product, then about uh, your buyer converter product, and how it is connected to the core product. And finally, of course, about your content strategy and uh, how it is connected uh, to your buyer converter product. Uh, marketers know that uh, there are stages in their user acquisition funnel. Attracting visitors, convert them to leads, bring them to, uh, into trial, sell, up and cross sell, and so on. That's nice, uh, it's the inbound marketing funnel, and I think uh, there are good examples uh, to implement it. But as a business owner, and a growth engineer, marketer, or customer success person, the only question is how you can think about it is there a framework? Is there a framework that helps you to build it? The inverted funnel concept is nothing more than building your funnels from your product's uh, point of view. Uh, that is the uh, heart of your offer. While you take your user's uh, pain point uh, uh, into account. You have to talk to your users about, your, uh, about their uh, difficulties. But uh, when you build your growth engine into your product, you have to create easy ways of entering it. That is uh, truly uh, a step-by-step -step process. For example, uh, you build the foundation firstly, not the roof when you build a house. So, so that, 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 uh, in, uh, in short, it, this is the inverted funnel concept. And, uh, and now, when we know what is the inverted, uh, in, inverted funnel concept, now I can answer your uh, or original question that what is the core product in, in, in this strategy? Uh, the core product is uh, your tool, your software. Uh, if you know which type of user uh, uh, uses uh, which features, then you will be able to identify your ideal customer profiles uh, easily and, uh, and uh, the solutions they are looking for. And identifying the ideal customer profile, the pain points of your prospect types, uh, and uh, what are they suffering for, from will be easier. And that's all, that, that, that's, the, that's the role of the uh, uh, core product in this uh, concept. Okay, so, it's interesting to get an overview of that inverted uh, funnel concept. I think that that gives people that um, that that sense of the, the direction. Uh, obviously, the core product, uh, and you mentioned there's kind of the three stages. So we, we've just talked about necessarily the core product. Then there's the the buyer converter product and the creating the hooks, if you like. So uh, is this a stage now where we move through to talk about um, the buyer converter? Yeah, yeah, I think the, the next log logical step to speak about is the buyer converter product because uh, it's, a, it's a tricky one. Uh, the, the buyer converter product is a standalone feature of your product, of your core product, that solves a specific pain point of a customer profile and it is uh, an indispensable offer, very cheap. Uh, it got the buyer converter name uh, as its purpose to convert your leads and or users into, uh, into paying customers, even if they pay uh, only a very little. Uh, if you can convert your leads into paying customers, the relationship uh, between your customers and you will be radically changed and uh, you will have better chance to upgrade them. 
Uh, also, the next logical step for your users is to upgrade to your core offer that uh, does something uh, uh, similar but much faster, much better uh, than your standalone feature. So the, this uh, buyer converter product is uh, uh, a simple uh, psychological hack. It's uh, because it's much more easier to upgrade a customer uh, from a cheap buyer converter product to a more expensive, expensive core product than if you would try to sell him uh, the core product in one step. So, so that's uh, why we use uh, this buyer converter concept.